the infotainment screen is quite big, uh, much bigger than the Nissan Leaf that I have. Uh, let's have a look at some, some of its functions. Here is the EV menu. I have 99% of battery remaining. This is showing the Oh oh oh. This is showing the diameter where I can travel. So what about pinch zoom? Oh no, pinch zoom is not working. So how can I zoom in? Can I use this button? Okay. This one is similar than the leaf. So I could get to Lithuania with that charge that I have. Okay, it's a pretty nice screen. I can tap on any place, see how far it is, whether it's matching the estimated range. So it seems that right now I could get from Tartu to Vilnius, which is 411 kilometers without any charge. That would be pretty impressive. Okay, let's see what else we have here in the EV menu. Uh, okay, nothing about eco driving. Mm, okay, I think I haven't driven enough for that. So here we see some uh, previous uh, economy ratings of the test drive car. Yeah, someone has been hammering it pretty hard. 26.7 energy consumption okay let's go back see what else we have here EV settings aha winter mode that seems useful you can uh, uh, yeah it's kind of uh, like battery heater for the leaf I guess mm, okay EV route, what is that? Ah, okay, uh, it seems that it will show uh, during navigation whether um, uh, you can reach the destination or not. That seems useful. We can try it out right now. So, uh, actually, I didn't try the uh, navigation at all. So, let's go to the navigation. Um, I will enter some place. Uh, okay, how can I search? Route. Uh, destination. Address. Okay, let's go to Lithuania. I went there this summer with my leaf. I did uh, three charging stops. So let's see what this car thinks. How well it could do it. So it was Klaipeda, Klaipeda, yeah, we find it. Um, okay, the city is enough. Set as destination. So what does it think? Okay, 548 kilometers. Uh, outside range, but but Starting just guidance. but just one charging stop okay battery charge insufficient so s search for charging station let's see what it finds i already found out that this is not so useful because it's not uh, actually showing the stations on the route or well it's not showing where my battery would end it's uh, just showing all the stations on the route so a tour point, okay. So what happens now? Start guidance. Starting route guidance. Okay, and so here you can see this EV trip information that uh, it will show for how long I have the battery also. Yeah. I think you can see it. Let's go back to home. All menus. 
uh, phone. Okay, here you can pair your phone. So climate set to 21 degrees, driver only. Uh, driver only, that's something you cannot uh, set in the leaf. So more from the EV settings here under energy information. I can also open. So from here we see very nicely the energy consumption. And let's make one experiment. Right now I have the heat turned off. But here is the button. I will turn the heat on. So it's set to 22 degrees. And we do see that climate control energy consumption is increasing. So it is indeed giving the correct information, the live data. What else from here? Uh, okay, here we see some uh, charging times with uh, DC charger. Okay, this is the charging limit. This is something that the leaf doesn't have. Uh, actually, it is good for the battery if you don't charge to 100%. I would keep it like that, charging to 80%. Then it's healthy for the battery. And uh, yeah, here also charging limits for AC charger. Okay. Okay, back to the music. Yeah, it's pretty good. So this is a kind of list view of the radio stations. So what else do we have here? Information. Traffic. Is this working? No, not in Estonia at least. Live charging stations. Is this working? In the leaf they have something like that, but uh, it's not working in reality. So these services that need connection to the internet, uh, it seems that uh, they are only possible with Wi-Fi. So you would need to create a hotspot with your phone. Uh, the Leaf has somehow uh, a little bit more connection. I think it has a 2G or 3G SIM card because it can fetch you some information at least without Wi-Fi.